Okay, we got seven plus 73, that's 80. Uh, okay, that's 106. 146 drops. And look, we're back on Kelsenio's account. If you guys watched the tournament credit opening video, we used his account to open up all those tournament credits and he's come back with all of his drops. So guys, leave compliments for him down below in the comments, please. Look at him, he's even using the Try How Love as his profile picture. He's a real one. Also, while you're leaving him a compliment, go follow him on Twitter. This is Kelsenio's Twitter. Look, 222 followers. You guys better at least get him to 250 or I'm gonna be disappointed. I'll leave the link down below in the pinned comments. Also, finally got my main setup moved over to my girlfriend's house but i forgot to pack the green screen up so no green screen for this video i'm sorry <laughs> all right so let's see what he's got on his account first so we know what to get him fire clap i wonder who got him that me it was it was me i got him it <laughs> titanium white mainframe jeez kels your inventory is kind of on the stack side he's got polypop stormwatch dueling dragons party time sub-zero kelsinio do you even need these items what is ballistic pro I want that. Okay, for exotics, he's got the Zowies, the Drenos, p -Sims. Oh my gosh, he's got a lot of exotic wheels too. Titanium White Dracos, Clockworks, Infiniums, Turbines. Okay, Kelsinio. Guys, I don't know what I'm gonna be able to get this, man. Titanium White Finnick, two two Titanium White Finnicks? Don't you think that's a little excessive, Kelsinio? You could, you could sell that. He's got Burnt Sienna, Gray, Black Standard. Titanium White Sparkles? Kels, can I have your inventory? Okay, black, titanium white, burnt sienna, pink octanes. Okay, basically guys, this man's inventory is so stacked. I'm just gonna be happy for whatever we get him uh, because he clearly does a lot of trading here. So if we get him items of value, he'll use those. There's nothing else we can do here for him. I mean, he's he's got it all. Okay, first item, here we go. Man, all right, so guys, here's what I'm gonna do. If we get a cool item, I'm gonna act as if it's the first time he's ever gotten it. Okay, Pigeon, that's not good. That <laughs> That's no good, <laughs> even if he are, didn't have it. Nobody cares about the Pigeon banner. Uncommon, here we go. Oh man, if we could get these in black. Black tunicas, titanium white, any color tunica is nice. I do prefer Sterns. Most people seem to like the tunicas more. I prefer Sterns. Cow skull always makes me think of Texas. Okay, we're gonna open up a bunch more of these uncommon drops. Normally, I skip a bunch of uncommons, like if we don't... I was about to say if we don't get anything good, and then we got what is arguably the worst item in the game, the Aftershock Tiger Tiger decal. I can put zero respect on this decal. So if we skip some of the uncommon items, don't be surprised, but Trails, you didn't actually open up all 150. It's because, yeah, the uncommons historically are not great, and I'm trying to save you guys from watching them, especially if we get Cow Skull again. The confetti boost is so cute. Okay, so, so far, best item we've gotten him, confetti boost. Not a good start. Or Aftershock Tiger Tiger, I guess. You know what? I'm gonna open up until we've got 15 of these things left, and if we don't get anything good, we're just gonna skip to the rares, because these things are... The uncommon drops really are just... They're not great. Marauder wheels, those are legacy. He doesn't need them. They probably have... I would imagine next to zero value. Like, to find somebody who'd buy a Marauder wheel has got to be hard. All right, two more left, and then we're just going to... We'll cut to, like, the last two uncommon drops. Here we go. A genie lamp. Not going to lie, didn't know that was in the game. There is a lot of, like, antennas and toppers that I honestly just forget about because you don't see people play with them much, so... Yeah, yeah, we're, we're skipping a bunch of items. All right, we only have two uncommons left. Let's just... Knock these out. We'll see if they're decent. So far, we got succulents. We got a derby topper. N no good things. Okay, now paint finishes. There are a lot of rare paint finishes that you can get un out of the uncommon drops that are actually pretty good and can change the look of your car completely. Uh, the chan Chantico? Chantic Chantico? I have no idea how to save this draft. This decal, not terrible, actually. You get much worse. Moving on, we're opening up the rare drops. Now, in this are the best items. The most expensive items you can get uh, out of the drops, you can get out of the rare drops. So imports, it's harder to get imports out of these, but they can become painted. So the titanium white octane's in here, which he doesn't need because he's already got one because it was in the item shop. But there's other painted variants of the octane. Uh, lots of painted variants of wheels, like OG wheels, like, like sterns, tunicas. All of those you can get painted out of here. Another rare. Uh, speaking of items of value, that, that, that doesn't have it. That has no value. <laughs> you know what that is? That's good for trading up. That's gonna be a great trade-up. The Proteus wheels? <laughs> no. I still need to try the Proteus, by the way. Uh, a lot of you guys have been coming over to my Twitch and telling me to use the Proteus. Um, lately, I have been sticking with the Octane because I've been playing pretty well with the Octane recently. Especially, I've been traveling a lot. Moving has been... 
Ooh. It's my favorite item for the video so far, the Reaper wheels. The Reaper wheels just look good on pretty much everything. Like, I... There's never a time where I'm like, you know what, the Reaper wheels just don't look good on this. It's like any car, any decal combo, it just looks, it looks great. Here we go, metallic smooth. Now, I didn't check all of Kelsinio's paint finishes because based off of his regular item inventory, I'm assuming he's stacked and has all the paint finishes. He did not have Crimson Invaders though. Ooh, ooh, those are nice. Yo, I gotta check. Did he have those? Invader? That was his first Crimson Invader. Cringe warning. Damn. You're welcome, Kelsinio. This man's inventory is so stacked. He has me playing on hard mode, opening these crates, and I still get him a good painted wheel. All right, so guys, as we're going along, keep track of your top three favorite items, then let me know down below in the comments, because I love to see you guys, like, whoever likes somebody else's choices, you know, and see which one has the most likes. Like, it's it's fun for me to do. But I'm def, me personally, I'm definitely putting those Crimson Vaders at number one. Those could potentially be my favorite item for this entire video, depending on how things go. Because any painted, very real wheel like that, massive W. The Thread X2s, not it. All right, here we go. Let's see what's next. Another very rare, good. Because that's where all of like the really good painted wheels are, I believe, are in very rare imports. When they come painted, very nice. Listen, they're not painted, but the Saptor Rishis, chef's kiss level good. All right, normally someplace around here we would be montaging the rest of the drops, but maybe we just power through. I don't know. No, because then that's more, that's more that Trev has to edit. Sorry, Trev. We'll probably montage. Let me open a couple more. We've gotten some good luck here. Dominus Dot Matrix. Okay, he doesn't use the Dominus as much. He said he uses the Octane, the Fennec. I think you put Dominus in there, but he also uses the Esper because as you guys know, I've been trying out the random funky cars of Rocket League and the Esper is actually pretty good. Listen, I overlooked the couple Dominus snake skins we got because it doesn't look bad on the Dominus. You can't convince me that the breakout snake skin is an import level decal. It's bad. It's a bad decal. It does not belong in import. Very rare. The argument could be made, but like, Oh my gosh, the Gizmo. Gizmo, one of the cars that I tested out. And Gizmo, good car. Gizmo, Esper, Venom, all good. The Vulcan. Guys, add it to the funky car list that I need to check out. The Vulcan. Haven't played with it, probably because it's hard to look at. At least like the Gizmo's cute. Ooh, another import? The Libertines. Okay, the Libertines, we get these most videos. I swear the import drop rate for Libertines is higher than anything else. I'm not gonna lie, I thought we got Black Standard, even though Black Standard's an import level boost. Ink, not bad though. The sound, a little hard to overcome for me. Rare, Let's see what we get. Clod Hoppers, might look good on like a Road Hog, or something where the wheels are like fully exposed, like the Esper. <laughs> Fishbowl, honestly, toppers should be uncommon. Like, they really should. To bring out a topper and rare, it just seems like that's not rare, it's a topper. It would have to be like something amazing like bush hat or gator or dinosaur. All right, spinner. So when we get down to 40 drops, I'm gonna have Trev montage up everything so we can like just show you like the highlights of these rare drops because all of the really good, we have like 30 very rare drops to get through on his account. So uh, I want this video to be less than an hour long. <laughs> So that's how we're gonna have to do this. Fire plugs. Guarantee you he's got a set of default of these, but he might be able to trade away fire plug. It's a really good wheel. Three left. See, another rare, another one. Sandstorm, no. That does not add to the funky boost list. Sparkles, great funky boost. Hydro, I'm hoping is good though. Nitrous, nitrous is okay. All right, final drop before the montage. Let's get it. Three. I bet you an import. Nah, rare. Go montage. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. We just started the montage off. Well, that's my new number one favorite item. Oh my God, those look amazing. Are those his first ones? They are. Favorited. You're welcome, Kels. <laughs> Back to it. Ooh, the Octane Ripped comic. Slept on decal. If you guys get this, feel lucky. Battle stars, oh my gosh. <laughs> Guys, add battle stars to the funky boosts I should try. 
The X Devil Purple. Guys, X Devil, I can't remember if I've tried this. Add this to the funky car list. But painted. Nice. Battle stars again. Yay! People clap. Woo! Guys, painted OEMs. Ooh, okay, I'll put that as my number three because it's Burnt Sienna and I think he already has those, but I'll put those other invaders at two. The Vulcan again. Hmm. Oh my gosh, guys, the painted wheel look this video has been amazing. Burnt Sienna Stearns? So nice. And he didn't have them. The Scarum, really? And the final rare drop for the montage, let's go. Let's see what we get. Okay, a rare? The Pollo Caliente. Honestly, a pretty good decal for the Dominus. Okay, so I don't know why the very rare drops are split up this way, but we'll open the loan, no, we'll save the loan very rare drop for last. So out of this, we can get very rare import exotics. The very rares and the imports technically have the highest value potential over the exotics because you can get them painted. And so like, you know, painted imports are worth quite a lot. And you can't get painted exotics out of this, which I don't know why Psyonix did it that way. Yes, I do. It's so you'd buy stuff from the item shop. But that's besides the point. I guess it also kind of helps the trading scene too, if the painted exotics, painted black markets are from other item series. But Psyonix just released the Titanium White Octane, so I doubt that really, they really care about the trading scene that much, which kind of stinks. I feel bad for everybody who's a trader. But who had a bunch of titanium white octanes and stuff. All right, this will be our fifth very rare. So far, nothing to write home about. Man, they keep pushing the Takumi Vector. I don't know why I get that decal every video. I don't know what the drop rate is for it, but it's gotta be huge. Import? The Kairos wheels. We got these in the montage, but getting an import out of these is still pretty good luck because it does allow you to trade up later. Like even if it's an unpainted import, we'll take it. The Guidance also got these in the montage. We actually got a lot of luck in those rare drops. A lot of very rares and imports. The Finnies also a wheel we get pretty commonly, but we take it. Up next, let's see. I hope we get at least an exotic out of here at some point. I feel like the exotic drop rates on this are just so low. I mean, the amount of times I get exotics out of 30 rare drops is so slim. Feels like it's even lower than like golden items. Octane Kilowatt, he's almost guaranteed to have that, but it's still a pretty good very rare decal. You see a lot of like people uh, use it that are like sweaty. Okay, if I get, you know what, we're resetting, we're resetting, going back to out of the menu. All right, we've reset the luck. Guys, man, those Thread X2s, if I got one more of them, I'm about to be agitated. It's just nonstop. All right, import? The High Rose, mm, these are a clean wheel. I want these in black. If we could get those in black for them, that'd be stellar. I actually don't know if they can come and black out of drops. Oh yeah, guys, that's my second favorite item for this video, those Lime Sterns. You put that on a different build and it's gonna look incredible. Dude, Kels, when I saw your inventory, I was worried we weren't gonna get anything that you'd actually use. And here we go, we got three wheels that you're, are all great. Dark Matter, more than three. We got two Invaders, one OEM, and two Painted Sterns. I know you're a trader, but there we go. Oh my gosh. I'm so over these wheels. These are the Aftershock Tiger Tiger of the very rare wheels. I tell, oh my gosh, it's getting to me again, isn't it? Oh, thank goodness, Hot Rocks, very rare trail. Anything, anything but the three. You know what, we're gonna click import. It doesn't do anything, but we're gonna, we're gonna do it anyways. All right, let's see if we can get lucky. Very rare. Anytime I get very rare, I'm just waiting for those wheels to come out again. Another very rare. We've gotten metallic pearl smooth. We've gotten pearlescent matte. We've gotten pearlescent. We've gotten them all the paint finishes, all the good ones. Even got anodized this video. Breakout dot matrix. Okay, we've gotten that a couple times. Let's click exotic. Let's be humble. We deserve an exotic this video for Kelsinio. Or some Thread X2s. Friction, one of the best trails in the game. I still use Titanium White Friction. I use that, classic, Titanium White Lightning sometimes. Import, Dark Matter again. Okay, resetting, we're resetting again. Only 14 total very rare drops left. This right here, import or greater, I can feel it. Please, please, or a very rare. Please don't be the Thread X2. <laughs> Straight line, another solid paint finish. Also guys, if you haven't checked out the paint finishes that are in this season's Rocket Pass, they were actually really good. The Endo MG88, I'm not gonna lie, this decal a little busy on the Endo, but for the Octane, great, great, great decal. 
Very rares. Dominus Snake Skin. Honestly, Kelsey is probably happy with just the wheels we got him. If we get him a painted import, that'd be nice though. The FSLs, another really good import wheel. We've gotten a lot of imports, a lot of very rares, but we haven't been getting like the big hitters, like painted imports or exotics. Breakout Vector, stop, guys, the Vector decal is not good. I can't remember the last time I saw somebody use Vector. It's just hard to design around too. The Reaper wheels again, they're so nice. I wonder if these have any trade value because they put the Reapers in a lot of golden crates too. So there's probably a ton of people that get them for free. What? Guys, it just straight up just didn't give us an item. Has this happened to anybody else? Surely, you know what, we'll go back. So remember, after the Reapers, there should be an item there. Maybe it just, maybe it's delayed? No shot, it just took a very rare drop from us. It takes forever to get those. I, I'd be so mad. Karyos three times in one video? There are a million imports we can get. What are the chances to pull that three times in one vid? Very rare. I imagine the Thread X2s. All right, only three of these guys left. And then we've got the solitary very rare drop. Oh, virtual wave, another really good boost. It just looks so good. I really wonder, like, does that, normally the only time that none thing has happened is when I have Bacchus mod doing something weird. Hyro wheels again. Okay, it says we have two left, but I think that's a glitch because I still think we have another very rare drop that's separate than this stack. And I don't know why that is. The Yuzos, unpainted. But the first time we got them in this video, so we'll take it. Okay, so now we're on to the last very rare drop. This is import or greater. Everybody watching has to subscribe. Three, two, one. Please be import. <laughs> and it's a very rare. Metallic Pearl Smooth. You know, we're gonna do the opposite this time. For the import drops, we're gonna open up the lone guy by himself. Now, we can get black markets out of here, but Kelsinio honestly had a pretty stacked black market list, so I don't know what else we can get him. Guys, add this Cyclone to the list of funky cars I need to try. And by funky, I mean sexy. This car is gorgeous. That's probably my like top 10 favorite items you pulled in this video, that Cyclone. That's really nice. Why is the snakeskin decal listed as an import? It just, it, it shouldn't be, especially for the Octane. The Octane has a million good decals. Why has that one got import level quality? The Proton Boost? Forgot that was in the game, but we'll take it. Oh my gosh, we're just hauling through these import drops. You only get one of these a season two. Please! You've gotta be kidding me. How many different vehicles have we gotten snakeskin for this video? All right, the final three. Come on, we gotta get something banger for Kelsinio. Exotic? The central wheels, good for purple design cars, obviously. And Kels already had the Dracos, the Zombas, so getting him exotic wheels he doesn't have, I'm sure he's happy with. And another import? The Werewolf. Honestly, I thought we got the Cyclone twice because the cars look so similar. Add the Werewolf to the list of funky cars I gotta try. And the final import drop for the video. All right, if this is painted or exotic or better, everybody watching has to subscribe. I don't make the rules. It's gonna be painted. No, it's not. <laughs> this is everything we got in today's video. I think the item that came in as none was actually a Dominus Snakeskin. Cause I can't remember what item I actually pulled next. So maybe that was it. Let me know what your top three favorite items for the video were down below in the comments. Make sure you leave a like, subscribe to the channel, use the border creator code Trials, and I'll see you guys next time.